Hey everyone, welcome back to Better Biomed. Today is a video I again wasn't expecting on making. Um, I don't know if this is a sad day for our industry or what. I, I just, I don't understand some companies in our industry. I, I just don't. So I, I had somebody uh, reach out to me recently who's a pretty well-known figure in this industry and anyway the company that she was working for wanted uh they made her sign something saying that every social media post she makes relevant to the company or not has to be approved by the company and that's absolutely wild to me because if something is on my personal social media account there's no way there's no way I'm running it through the company as long as I'm not being critical of that company. Uh, it, that just doesn't make any damn sense to me. So I, I'm, I'm trying to keep this as, as modest as possible and, and as easygoing a video as possible. Uh, because obviously when you only know, let's say, one side of the story, it's easy to maybe get the wrong information. However, this is one point on the story that I just can't get past. I really can't. So here's the thing, um, my company, since I, I do social media, obviously, my company knows this when they hired me, just like this, this lady's company, they knew that she did social media. Um, my company would never, would never tell me what I will and will not post on social media. Phoebe Medical, I've, I've interviewed their competitors, I've interviewed uh, and I've gone over competing products than what we're authorized to sell. And no matter what I've done, my company has not said, Justin, please run your social media posts by us before you post them. My company, uh, Phoebe Medical, is uh, run by a veteran. It's a veteran owned company and we are staunch supporters of things like freedom of speech. However, this is also Texas, and if I were to come out and publicly criticize my company, I would completely expect to be let go. And, and I actually support that. I mean, because if I, if I didn't really support the things that my company was doing, then why am I with this company? Um, so that's, that's one of the things you gotta think of. So I'm trying to remain as even and non-biased on this video as possible, but here's the thing. They did make her sign something saying that they will see every post before she posts them or else she'll be terminated. And then I, I also heard, I heard that she wrote a speech because she's trying to get more involved with the community. Per my suggestion and, and some of the other um, social media people, we've, we've kind of gotten together and we're trying to, we're trying to make this a better place, man. So I've, I've talked with this person and I told her, hey, um, try to do more public speaking, try to get more involved, you know, and I know some of the other people have told her just the same, and I, t I say it to everybody. But, um, so she wrote a speech on, on females in the work environment, and you, you have to imagine, a speech like that is not gonna be all roses and rainbows, okay? It just isn't. Just like if a junior biomed were to write a speech about what it's like getting started in biomed. I do not expect that to be roses and rainbows, okay? Because it won't be. There's gonna be some things that have to change. I know that, I talk about it all the time. You guys hear that. And just the same, females in the work environment, I have seen some of this stuff happen myself. And that's just from what I've witnessed. I'm not even in the room all the time as a female. So, I mean, imagine all the stuff that they see. But the thing is, is if you try to hush what people have witnessed and experienced, then there's no dialogue. And if there's no dialogue, then this will never get fixed. And I think we are pretty clear that our industry has to change, all right? We have to change. And the thing is, is I think it has honestly changed quite a bit for the better. I mean, some of the some of the old school mentalities for uh, micromanaging shops and stuff. A lot of that has changed. There's there's a lot more empowerment, and you know there is a lot more opinions on how to do business. And some of these opinions are much better. And I have to admit, 
a lot of these opinions and, and whatnot are relevant to females. It's a lot of it are their ideas. So, I mean, the thing is, is if, if a female writes a speech about what it's like being a female in the work environment, as long as she is not saying, I have seen this at this job, as long as she says, I've seen this throughout my career, there should be no issue. Again, I haven't seen the speech, so I'm just telling you guys just what I've heard and, and the fact that somebody wants to censor that that kind of conversation is, is automatically discouraging. So I would think that it is a um, male-run company that would want to censor that kind of behavior. I There's no way I would ever support that. Um, I think a dialogue is, is healthy in every situation out there. And uh, trying to censor somebody's opinion or their experiences are obviously the wrong way to go. So I'm, I'm a little bit confused on this because she went to go and give this speech and they gave her a speech that was completely rewritten. They said, this is the speech you're gonna give, not the one that you had. And when she got to this location, she gave the speech it was her original speech and not the one that they wanted her to give. And from my impression, and from what I, from what I understand, because she gave her original speech and, and not the one that the company wanted her to give, as of today, she has been let go from that company. Again, I don't know both sides of the story, and I will openly admit that. I do think that this is a step back for us as an industry and it shows that there are some bigger problems out there. So uh, all I can say guys is be weary of what you post on social media, obviously. Uh, I, I have to deal with that every single day. However, censoring in many ways is, is not okay. It's not okay guys. And uh, companies censoring employees. If, if, if my company ever said that to me, that, hey, Justin, uh, we don't like you putting out this kind of content or we want you to put out more content on us. If you notice, I, I put out some content on Phoebe Medical, but uh, they have never said, hey, Justin, do another video for us. Notice that every time I've done a video, it's based on something that I felt needed to be said. And uh, it's something that we learned when we were on site or something like that. It's not because Phoebe said, hey, like, Justin, you need two videos this week. That has never happened. And they never said, hey, we need to approve those videos before they go live. Never happened. It's a mutual respect. And the thing is, I, I would never handle that kind of censorship where somebody says, oh, wait a minute, that's, that's really not okay. Given, I, I try to keep this channel as neutral as possible, I, I would think, but guys, I don't know. Again, I don't know both sides of the story, but I definitely know that this is a problem. There's there's definitely a bigger problem here, and censorship is one of them. And I, I have proof in my email that yes, in fact, she was definitely asked to uh, sign something saying that all social media posts are going to be approved by the company or else she's going to be terminated. I do have a problem with that. Okay. That's her personal accounts, not not the company accounts. So yeah, there's there's bigger issues out there, guys. So just want you guys to know that uh, I don't approve of censorship, and you know I I support this individual. I I would obviously like to know more about the situation, but I definitely support this individual. So um, guys, if you have had these kind of problems with your companies, I'd be interested in hearing more. You can even write me at a better at gmail.com. Um, if that way there we can keep it private you don't have to post it publicly down below in the comments but I'm just curious have you guys seen this kind of problem for your location just wondering guys I think it's a bigger issue with uh, the industry at the moment